So for this unit, you are going to be learning about continents, oceans, and countries and physical features of the world. So we're going to start out with the continents and oceans. So I want you to turn in your book to page 33 in chapter 5. Continents and oceans on maps and globes. Earth's seven continents. I want you to go ahead and write the number seven. That way you can remember. So continents are large land masses surrounded by water. There are seven major continents on Earth, and go ahead and underline with, with me as I read them aloud. The seven continents are North America, which is where you live, South America, Africa, Europe, Asia, Australia, and Antarctica. Notice all but Europe have an A, so they are a little bit tricky to remember, but just try your best. You can see what the continents look like by looking at maps and globes. Satellites take photographs of Earth from space. These photographs also show what the continents look like. And here is your fascinating fact. It says Europe and Asia are connected, but they are considered two different continents. The large landmass that includes Europe and Asia is sometimes called Eurasia. Europe is a giant peninsula on this island mass. And then we have charts and graphs. It says this table lists the continents in alphabetical order. Write the names of the continents in order by size from largest to smallest. So what you're going to do is you're going to look in the millions place. So we have ones place, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands, and then we have millions. I don't know if you've learned that in math yet. But you're going to look at the millions place to help you figure out which one has the largest and the smallest and you'll go in order. So um, I will help you out with the first one so you can see that these both have two digits in the millions place or aka they have um, one in the millions place and then one also in the ten millions place. So you can see 17 is larger than 11, so 17,139,000 is larger than 11,677,240. So Asia would be first, and then Africa. And then I want you to go through the rest of them and answer those, and then flip to page 34. So you have to flip your book this way. It says the continents on this map are numbered 1 to 7 from largest to smallest. Use your answers from the charts and graphs activity on the previous page to label the continents. So I want you to go ahead and do that. And then once you finish that, um, move on to page 35. And it has the oceans. So oceans are large bodies of water on Earth. Earth's Five major oceans, go ahead and get ready to underline, are the Atlantic Ocean, Pacific Ocean, Arctic Ocean, Indian Ocean, and Southern Ocean. It says, use the table to locate Earth's five major oceans on the map below. Write the corresponding number to the left of each ocean name. So I want you to go through and do this using your skills with a compass rose right here. Um, go ahead and go through the oceans and locations. I'll help you with the first one. It says Pacific Ocean to the west of North and South America. So I know this is North America and you can actually go ahead and label those to make it easier for you. And this is South America. So I know it's to the west. Well if I look right here I know that this way is west so that would be number five. Number five is the Pacific Ocean and then I'm going to write it as well and I want you to also write it. That way you can just look at this map. So go ahead and label the map and write that down and then do the work on PLP.